It's like 5 a.m. And we're going hot air balloon. My dog's been up for like 45 minutes already. Chip says, I got no time to be waking up early. You guys can go do your thing, but just leave me here. Good morning guys, welcome to today's vlog. Like Cameron said, we're going on a hot air balloon. So we are excited, so I'll take you along. <laughs> I'm nervous. He's like, we might have a windy landing and in, in the event of a windy landing. <laughs> the balloon drags on the ground and the basket tips over and you guys all land on top of each other. <laughs> he doesn't help the people that are a little nervous. He, he <laughs> for sure has mad dog stressed out the whole time, but he was like joking around. Like people do this every day all the time. It's probably, I don't know. I mean, it's tough to imagine it's safer than an airplane, but. on the hot air balloon. It was actually so much fun. I'm super scared of heights, so I was a little nervous, but it didn't even feel like you were that high. So I would definitely recommend. And an update on the couple that I thought was getting engaged. They did, I knew it. They had a sign for her that said, will you marry me, Mallory? And she was on a separate balloon, all private, but I knew it, so congratulations to them. But yeah, I would 100% recommend doing that. It was really, really fun. And they give you like a mimosa after and some snacks. It was really fun. I am editing the vlog that was previous to this one. So the first one will be a little rough. Hopefully this one that you're watching is a little bit better. But I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far. It's been really fun. So yeah, we'll keep them coming. So, we're going to Dr. G get adjusted. I don't get adjusted. You're not about it. I'm not about it. I don't like to be touched or popped or cracked. Necessary for athletes, I guess. You don't know what a vlog is? I'm, I'm too old to know what a vlog is. She knows exactly what a it's vlog is. a video is. and a blog mixed together yeah, but what makes is a it? vlog. My question is, what does blog stand for? Blog stands for business litigation and opportunities galore. I came off of that with a thought. Yeah, that was good, though. That was good. Like You made it sound like pretty like... 
Like you knew what you were talking about. So you do that often. So a blog is one thing, and then a video is just the video portion of a blog. Yeah. So it's called a blog. Blog. But I still don't know what that is. Hey, I have a question. When a girl tucks in her shirt in the front, oh my gosh, what's that called? A soft tuck? Front tuck. Front tuck. That's uh-huh. stupid. That just means she went to the bathroom and forgot her, her <laughs> in the front part of the thing. And, and now it's cool? Like, who made that cool? I'm like a full tuck. You're full tuck? Everything? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You don't just soft tuck it? No. What's it called when you just get stuck in the back of your pants? Because that happens to me all the time. That's, <laughs> That's an accident. That's an accident. <laughs> that means you just pooped your pants? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Just a little coffee. These are like the coffees in Europe. I remember when I went to Europe, like 2018 off season. Uh, I was like, I love coffee, obviously, but I always would get like a 20 ounce iced coffee, you know what I mean? Like, obviously I always go for the big mm-hmm. boy. And uh, I got to Europe and everything, this was a coffee. That's you know? a large. This is just, there's not even really sizes. It was, yeah. what is this, like 10 ounces, I don't know? Eight ounce. Yeah. And it's just what your coffee was, which is a realistic serving size. Mm-hmm. But. We do a big and I've learned to be able to appreciate just sipping on a small coffee. You know what it kind of feels like in here? What? Australia. Yeah. That's a bucket list for me. I would really want to Stuff by G. Had some work done. And now the traffic's so bad that I might as well just have a coffee and hang out and let it die down. Good morning. I just finished getting ready. Um, I have some random things to do around the house today. Uh, my sister's flying in today, this afternoon. She is flying in because we're going wedding dress shopping this week. I'm so excited. I've had this appointment for a couple months now at Grace Loves Lace. That's where I'm getting my dress from. And I'm so excited to finally go. I'm going in with an open mind because I hear every time someone has a vision of what they want and then they go in and they get something completely different. So going in with an open mind, but I'm really excited. So we're doing that on Thursday. Today's Tuesday. Also my outfit today, this talentless hoodie. I have probably like 15 talentless hoodies. They're literally the best. They're our favorite. Cameron wears them too. And we like to match sometimes. I don't think he has this one, but talentless, you need to get it. They are the best. I'm gonna open packages that I just got today. I ordered a bunch of anthropology candles around Christmas time, and one of them came completely shattered. So I got a replacement. Hopefully this one is not shattered as well. Oh, we're good. Literally best candles of life. Okay, so I don't really wanna wear makeup today because um, I don't wanna like scrub off any extra self tanner that basically I don't want my self tanner to look patchy tomorrow so to help that I'm not gonna wear makeup today if that makes sense put some like eye brightener on curl my eyelashes so I'm just gonna put this under my eyes that feels good I'm actually gonna put this like on all the highlight points of my face and I'm gonna do my soap brow and just Brush them up. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. And then I'm just gonna use a tinted like chapstick. Just give a little more color. All right. Okay, sorry, camera died. Um, my outfit. This is a really old shirt from Urban. I don't know if they sell this anymore. And then these pants that I showed you were from Princess Polly. So this is the look. So super casual. Going shopping today. My sister came into town last night, as you guys saw. So we gonna go do a little bit of shopping. I need to go to Sephora and grab some things. And then my parents fly in tonight uh, for the wedding dress shopping tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Good morning, vlog. I'm vlogging for you today. I'm gonna follow you everywhere you go. Oh, that sounds scary. It's not going to be that interesting. Mail. 
trash. Cameron said it's just a bunch of bills. It's Wait, all mail. Is is. When I was a kid, yeah, it's all trash. When I was a kid, my mom would talk about like, oh yeah, the mail, it's just a bunch of bills. And I was like, yeah, whatever. It just like didn't cross my mind. Yeah, no, it's, it's it really just is. We are going to G. Mm -hmm. Well, he's going to G. And we are going to South Coast Plaza. Mm -hmm. We're going to go to Sephora and probably free people. Mm -hmm. so I have rice aroni in the microwave. Yes, she does. <laughs> breakfast my, of champions. For my healthy breakfast. Mm -hmm. What do you think of that? Cam had mm -hmm. eggs and leftover dinner, right? And he had oatmeal this morning. I had oatmeal before my bike ride, but. And oatmeal. Now he had. Did you already have your coffee? Oh yeah. Yeah, I had my coffee at like 6.30. So. Yeah. I forget you guys wake up at the crack of dawn. I went to Starbucks and got a vanilla sweet cream cold brew. Mm. Those, are nice. Those are the best. Yeah. You really know what my good. my new drink has been lately? What? It has been a iced peppermint mocha. Or a hot, really? depending on the temperature. My rice roni's done. You know, I can't get down with the mocha thing. Like I, just, I don't like a normal mocha, I only like a peppermint mocha. Okay, I'll try it. But it tastes like it tastes like a hot chocolate. Is it overly sweet? You can get it half sweet. It just tastes like peppermint hot chocolate. Okay. But it has caffeine. Maybe I'll try. It's six o'clock now. I haven't checked in in a while. But I went to Sephora. I'm gonna do a Sephora haul. I got quite a few things here. I'm very excited about. Do you want to see that? He hasn't even seen yet. Um. They finally had my shade in this, so I got this. The Hollywood flawless filter, whatever it is. This looked like my color, so hopefully it is. So, happy about that. And then I got the Pillow Talk lipstick. There she is. Oh, focus. Oh yeah, there it is. Then I've been wanting to try this foundation. So I got the Ilia Super Serum Skin Tint in the color Sheila. Super serum, huh? Super serum. It's like a no makeup makeup look. The best product ever. The, I actually don't know how to say. Lin Where is it? I think it's Lina Linage, Linage. So yeah, I got this, but I got it in a gummy bear. And then the last thing I got is this Rare Beauty Cream. <laughs> blush in the color hope. Is that the one we kind of went on the hunt for? Am I jamming, yeah, the am I, am I jamming the style with this? Uh... A little bit, but it's fine. I'll wait. So I got the Rare Beauty cream blush. Oh! <laughs> it smells so good, actually. Actually, another. I haven't. Does it actually clean well? Yeah, it does. It actually does. Anyway, this is in the color Hope. Um, the one, the color I actually wanted, they didn't have. So I got that one. I settled. I got the same um, lip mask thing that she did, but Which? I got the regular one. Um, Gummy bear. What um, flavor is this? Why are my lips purple? Didn't you say this is like pear or something? No, they have pear. Oh. I think this one's like rose. I don't know. I got that. I don't know, it's like its own flavor. It's It kind of tastes like candy too. You've been using this stuff for years and I think I've used it one time. And just randomly, I started thinking about it a couple days ago. I think because my lips are chapped right now. And, but I, I couldn't remember the name of it and I almost texted you. It's the best. It really is the best. They make it in like a, like a lip balm too now. Okay, I got these. Um, I have put everybody onto these. They're like de-bloating pills. They really work. They're like insane. I ordered them randomly. I didn't even know what they did until I like got them in the mail. And they help with digestion too. So 10 out of 10. I've gotten pretty much all my friends on it. The those. reason I like these is because they work instantly. It literally within like a minute. They do. Okay, then I got this stuff that you told me was good. It's called, I haven't tried it yet, but I've heard it's good. It's called Ilia, I guess. I got, that's the same one I got. We got it in the oh, same color, right. I think. Yeah, I've been wearing the Anastasia foundation, but for some reason it just sits on top of my skin. Like it just doesn't, it doesn't look good. So I'm gonna try this. All right, that was our haul. 
Look how glowy my skin is. Yay. But exciting because we're going wedding dress shopping <gasps> tomorrow. I'm going to be crying all day. Me too. I'm... My, one of my friends gifted me a makeup artist tomorrow. It's kind of, I guess, like a wedding day makeup trial. She's gonna do my makeup for the wedding dress fitting. Mm -hmm. So I'm so excited. And then my friend's gonna do my hair. Yeah, it's Sarah, gonna be so she's much fun. And we're going to lunch after. I'm nervous. Um, I know we're gonna find it, so I'm not stressed about not finding it. I'm just curious to see what I end up actually getting. I have a lot. I have all the names saved of the ones that I want to try on. So I have like nine. I don't know how many I'll actually try on, but I, I'm prepared. I have a list. I have a list of the veils too because I'm a psycho. So apparently, you only get like an hour, right? The normal appointments, um, you get an hour and you can only try on five dresses, but they made the appointment for me because they're gifting me the dress. I'm, I'm not sure if I can try on more than five and if I get longer than an hour, but I can't imagine that I would need longer than an hour. Yeah. You know, like if I if I don't like a certain dress, I feel like I'm just gonna take just it gonna off. Take it'll it be off. like a yeah. five minute thing. Hi. Well, I always get nervous about parking. <laughs> I know we're twins. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm so much scared. I'm not Are cold, I'm just scared. Thank you, Target. So it's like an old church building. died when we were at the the camera died when we were at the dress place so I didn't get to give an update but I found my dress um, it's perfect um, I'm not going to give any hints or anything at all because obviously camera watches you just want to edit them so I'm not going to tell you anything about it. I did post the ones that I didn't end up getting on my TikToks. So if you want to go look at those, I might put a few clips of those in here too. But I found my dress. It is perfect and I can't wait for everyone to see it. We're, we're watching Supercross at home. Bummed we can't go, but it'll be fun to watch from home. <laughs> Talentless set, my favorite, the brown one. Talentless is the best. Um, 
We're, it's Saturday, like I said last night. We will not be attending A1, sadly. Um, so we're gonna do a watch party and we're gonna do Chipotle catering. And we've never had Chipotle catering. I've been slacking on the vlog the last two days. Sorry guys. Huh? I'm talking to the vlog. Oh, you vlog? I've been slacking the last couple of days because we've been busy. I feel like every time you vlog, I'm gonna make it on You're right. I'm oh, nice. Wow. Hi, Sean. Oh, that is a lot of corn. How are you? This is nice. It comes with all the bowls. Does it come with the black fork? Because that's the best part of Chipotle. I don't think it does. You'll vlog if it smells. Wow, this looks really good. We should do this more. Chipotle catering. Talk about an easy dinner to feed a lot of people. Right? Doodle, what do you think? We're bringing Chip to Irvine Spectrum today. Uh, he doesn't get out of the house much other than uh, a walk in a potty. He wants to meet new friends. Yeah, so we decided to bring him. We're going, oh, that guy is shredding. So we're going to Irvine Spectrum. We're gonna go get lunch, walk around. Our usual Sunday activity during the off season. No, here's how our Sunday goes, I wanna. Okay, go So in Here. the off season, so in the off season, um, well, even during the season really, uh, the Sunday is like my only actual day off. All we have to do is like some stretching stuff. So we get up in the morning, have coffee, breakfast, and then we had a nice breakfast this morning. Yeah, I made a, a whole spread. Breakfast. I made a whole spread. I chefed up breakfast too. You did. Yep. Good, good work. Um, and then we clean up around the house. Like we do probably like an hour and a half of cleaning, like together. Yeah, tag team it. Like our recap yep. cleaning day, like deep clean day. Because we like to have the house like clean for Monday for the week. And then we just do like spot cleaning throughout the week. Throughout yeah. the week yeah. So we'll clean and then I'll shower and she gets ready. And then we always try and go like somewhere, like whether it's like Newport area or somewhere not like super local where, cause we just like all week, we just, everything's just like so point A busy. to point B and just like a plan and something to do. So we like to go to like basically Orange County. Yeah. Somewhere. Yeah, I usually have to do my stretching stuff and a spin and then. Lots of. Lots of necessary chilling for this guy on Sundays. Yeah. Yeah, ideally, I'm laying on the couch all day, but that's really tough for me to do. Um, I get really bored. We switched. Oh, it's freaking burning hot. We went to our barn spectrum, like we said. And where did we end up eating? Tender greens? Tender greens. Wow, every place we wanted to go to was closed. What did you get? Chip got to walk around. I got, <laughs> I got chicken, rice, and veggies. <laughs> Wait, so did I. I just got, see a nice little different version of it is good. I had sushi rice and panko crusted chicken. 10 out of 10, we should make that at home. And homie back here got in trouble. A lot of times because he's very vocal about wanting to be friends with some dogs. He honestly sounds really scary when he freaks out on another dog. I'm like, Damn. Or when he barks at the door. He has a scary bark, but he wouldn't even hurt a fly. What's this fog right now? Is it just a... Uh... This is from hot air ballooning to today. Hot air ballooning, wedding dress shopping, just some other random crap. Okay. Yeah, like the week. The Stuff week. Stuff you did during the week. Yep. I think we're going to take the week off. Can you give me directions, babe? Yep. We're going to take the week off from vlogging, going back to Nashville to write some songs. And then the vlog will be back. Mm -hmm. See you in the next one. Vlog out. <laughs>